generic greetings and welcome back to PC Building Simulator where apparently someone that looks like Jeremy Kyle is on a poster. Apparently that is Marcus Appel and I've never heard of him. Either way, in the previous episode we got a couple of jobs done and made decent money but we've still got, <laughs> we've still got the uh, Van Cleef saga going. Basically, yeah, I'm over the cliff edge, hang on for dear life and while you despair as well hillstones and treads on my fingers. Yes, I'm doomed. Why by extension? Literally doomed with me. We're starting the computer's hard drive, countless hours of torturous banality, feeding my life's work in this <laughs> unfeeling machine, and all for naught. The hard drive failed, uh, you replaced with another. Uh, ergo, all was lost? For you not. I did not blame you or blame my editor for posing the Sisvian task in the first place. <laughs> oh, good grief. Um. Anyway, uh, we've got... What, do we just diagnose and fix? No longer turns on. It's fine by me, but my area is blaming. Uh, it's been, been intolerated, anxious, blah, blah, fix it. Okay, another one there. This is Alt Repair Service. Probably on a computer. Um, as I use it to organize my meetings with local uh, Woodsy Alliance group and share my thoughts on Roller, it's very important that it be returned to working order. Uh, I great believe in natural healing process and the power of positive energy. First, I'd like you to conduct an ultimate repair session. This requires you to dim the lights in your workshop, light some candles, and fully relax. You don't have to work. Don't have to wear clothes if you don't want to. What? <laughs> As you relax, focus your thoughts on my computer and channel your energy flow to mask and repair the damage components. Following mantra may help guide you. Uh, ra pa ma ku pu ta. Discard. Right. Um, so. Uh, you work with computers, yes, all the time. So my rig is running really slowly of late and I need you to upgrade the CPU. Can you run 3D Mark, make sure it's all working? No bother. This one, uh, PC is fast enough right now, please upgrade the graphics card. Can you run 3D Mark to make sure it's all working properly? Do it before um, 2618, which is 13 days. Cheers, Christopher. Okay, so we need, well, we don't really know what the uh, card is, so I guess we'll just accept all of those jobs and we will end the day. Pay rent of 500 which is by the end of today so that is hopefully an easy one. Let's actually go over and um, we will pay that rent. There we go. So that is now upgraded. Oh sorry, uh, that's paid. Upgrade we've got, oh that's diagnose and fix. Upgrade and upgrade. So we'll go for, well just this one here. We'll, we'll fast track uh, we'll fast track um, <laughs> Van Cleef's. So it's um, diagnose and fix. So it ain't working in. Let's see. Let's install. Let's just put the power cable in and power it up. No. Okay, looks like we're going to have to put everything else in. I'm going to see if the fans spin. Power. Nothing. Absolutely nothing. Okay. Sounds like the... That's dead again. Okay. What I'll do, I'll go to cable mode. It might just be a cable. Nope. Doesn't look like it. Okay, so we're just going to remove that and we will check the PSU. I'm assuming it's the PSU again, which I'm pretty sure a couple of episodes ago. Oh, is that the back? I've just started removing. There you go. Don't want to do that. I'm assuming that it is this one. And I did say a couple of episodes ago when I put this other one in, probably not a good idea. Did it anyway. Don't know if this... I don't know if this event would kick off based on what we put in, but I mean, there's no real way to tell, I guess. No, it's working. Right. That's interesting. Um. So. Yeah. That's actually okay. So what the hell is it then? Hmm. Do I really want to... I mean, could it be the motherboard? It could. Be. It's the only thing we haven't replaced so far. Um. Well, it won't power up. It won't boot anyway. So, let's just connect all the... No, let's not collect all the cables, shall we? In fact, no. Let, let's connect... No, no. Let's just start removing components until we know which one's which. Because it won't even boot. And there's no post thing we can use. Graphics card working fine. Processor 
let's have a look at that. Processor is fine. That is probably a fair crocodile shoes. Which isn't this one. That's Van Cleef's. I don't know. I'm going to go ahead and assume that it is the motherboard, quite frankly. Which is a shame because it means a lot of <laughs> a lot of things have to be removed. And if it's not, then oh, it's going to be a nightmare. Right, so it's a bit of open heart surgery on this thing, anyway. And then the standoffs to come out as well. Which is daft when really we're just going to replace it with the same thing. Okay. Other boards? Yeah, knackered. Okay. That's fine. It's not, well, it's good that we figured out that it's that. Um, it is Z170. It's that one there. No, it's not. No, no, no. It's the standard. How much does it give us? 260. You know what? I'm going to put the plus in because... Actually, do we need the plus? We could put a better... Let's put the best one we can in. Because we, cause we can, essentially. Because we can. Okay, so there's his machine. So, we'll be sorting that one out. Let's just go for the next one then. So, this is... Upgrade CPU. We might, depending on what socket that is, be able to do it now. Because we do have a couple in stock, you see. Alright, so tip that comes off, and it's not something we can upgrade. That's a shame. So, that is, it was that one there, which we already have in stock anyway. Okay. So they have paid us 180. So it is that one. So 180, the only one we can afford is that one. That's fine. Right, there's another one. Done. And this one is upgrade upgrade graphics card. I'm just going to take that off the bench. I really want another bench. Oh, where can we put it? Can we put it here? We can still. That's fine. Because that one's just, you know, sort that processor out. So this one is, when it comes to graphics cards... Let's have a look. A GTX 1050. Okay. So GTX... 10.50 So if we get like a I don't know A 9.60 That should sort it out How much of the pay does 195 Well can we get that for 195 9.60 Yeah we can Yeah yeah um, So They've got 1050s. There's no 1050s. No, they've got a 1050. One of these variants here, but they're all there. And if we get a... LE100. That's there. What about 4G LE? That's better as well. And the 2G is even better. But the 2G is... Mm, that two two's alright. Two's alright, but... 180. That one is okay. Um, what colour is their machine? Not really anything, but they've got a red one in, so we'll do that. Let's pick it on the colour of the card. That's always useful. <laughs> um, I actually know someone that bought a computer with a worse spec because she liked it because it was pink. And fair point, you know, their money, no problem whatsoever. But, um, yes, it was... A worse machine for an extra £50. So, hey-ho. 
I mean, you know, I could have just bought a can of spray paint and sorted it right out, but hey ho. <laughs> Let's just do this. Uh, so we're going to take this graphics card out. I'm going to shove the better one in. I call the job done there. Uh, graphics card. Yeah. Not much different. Same brand though. Same brand and same colour. So that's good. It, by total coincidence, by the way, I didn't, uh, <laughs> I didn't plan any of that. It just happened to be... Well, actually, the colour was... You know, me trying to match it up, but the rest was not. So, parts. But what's it called, actually? I want to check again. It's a PCI lock. Alright. Oh, so it goes over that bit there. Ah, oh, fair enough. So you can't take them out. Eh, that's a thing, I guess. Um, let's see, these side panels are just, there's just generic side panels. They're not one spe for specific cases. At least I don't think so. Um,. Install USB pen, power it up, and then we'll get 3D mark on the go. Hmm. Today's beverage is still uh, strawberry milkshake, by the way. Right, fire that up. Right, so while that's running, we will oh, good grief get this sorted. So motherboard, we will sell that one, and we will get this other motherboard in. Now I'm hoping that it doesn't say you haven't got the right motherboard in. So if it does, then I'm stuck with this other one. Hmm. We'll see though. So processors. Go, close that up. Thermal compound. There we are. And then all of these ones as well. I don't know how much RAM they had. Oh, loads. One thing that's never occurred to me, actually, is... Is this keeping... Is this remembering all of the components we've put in? So if we've... Um, upgraded the RAM... With, say... Say you needed 8 gig. The request was 8 gig. And we've put in 8 gig in them four sticks. Does it remember that? I think it does. So some, it springs to mind that we've done something like that before. Hmm. Yeah, maybe, maybe. Anyway, uh, that doesn't boot. What have I forgotten? There'll be a cable somewhere. Hang on. Yeah, the power button. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> I don't know if there's going to be like a rating system like uh, left on like to computers maybe later on in the game um, it'll be a case of you get like a rating for your work uh, the reliability spec that you've given things like that and that would you know that would alter the things that you get in such maybe that'd be uh, that'd be quite good I think anyway new parts so we'll discard that uh, so free at last. So the fates work in mysterious ways. My technology minded friend seems my publishers are willing to offer a second advance on my current work in progress, leaving me utterly uh, destitute and unable to afford the endless stream of electronic nonsense I've been forced to purchase. Just keep my head happy. Well, I won't stand for it. I am award-winning author after all, so I've decided to sell this computer, the electronic laughing stock, the pox of literature, and s slink back to my typewriter in the hope of rediscovering my muse. Well, it's not too late. Many thanks for your work at this point, but your service is no longer required. Best regards, Bruce Van Cleef. That's a shame. <laughs> That's a shame, that. I don't know whether we've done that by doing substandard work. But hey-ho. Good luck to you, Bruce. Okay, so. Hello, I just ran into say that the alternate uh, repair session had no effect. Most likely you conducted the healing ritual incorrectly, but that's okay, you are a novice after all. Send my computer to your, your workshop so you can do it by hand, on the condition that you conduct the appropriate rituals to ensure that the physical changes won't affect the positive energy of the machine as a whole. Is this, is this like the cult mechanicus? Is this Warmer 40,000 now? <laughs> 
Do we have to do some um, chants and offer a prayer to the machine spirit? <laughs> oh, diagnose and fix. Anyway, so. Uh, that's done. That one we will... Uh, oh, that's ready to boot. That one's been done, actually. So that is sorted. Leave by the door. Excellent. That's good. So we'll put that uh, there. This one is upgrade. So we'll put it there for now. And we will uh, collect that money. That's fine. Um, so this one is upgrade CPU and run 3D Mark. So we will install CPU processors. It is that one there. And obviously we need to put that in there. We'll close that up. Install the thermal compound. Uh, cooling is... I don't know. That, that says use, so I'm guessing it's that one. Um, cables is that. And obviously we do need to run 3D Mark, so it's best that I do this now. Put all the cables in while I'm in cable mode. Install the side panel. Do that and that. Get those sorted. And obviously we also need to put in the USB pen and power up. Okay. So firing up MegaOS, another, another nice background there. Uh, 3D Mark. And then run that, and then we've got a couple of um, couple of jobs on the computer there. On the cogitator, if we're going for all 40k stuff. <laughs> and we will run that. Okay, so while that's running, we'll check this one. So this one is, my PC isn't fast enough right now, please upgrade the graphics card so we can run 3D Mark sure it's all working properly. Yep, that's fine, we can just that we've done that one. Uh, that one is in transit. So, Van Cleef does again, just found a magnificent article about yours truly from the Metropolitan Literary Express. What really surprised me about Van Cleef is that he continues to work at all. He's managed such a bizarre talent that it's wondering he hasn't yet been able to taken away by the aliens who we presume dropped him off in the first place. Instead, cons <laughs> consensus to uh, the rest of his mom emails, pulling away the title of the book which is due to come out several years late, full of prose and Prose so incomprehensible to the common reader that it's hard to believe a human had any hand in writing it. Isn't that marvellous? We've always thought myself as an author who transcends base literature, but I have to confirm by the MLE that it's real feather in my cap. Please don't make sure to pre-order my upcoming work as an additional little bonus for all the work you've done for me. I'll be happy to sign a copy for free. Small fee. Discard. <laughs> Why are they all stalkers? <laughs> oh, what's up? Right, okay, so... I need upgrade my PC. Can you put 4 gigabyte of RAM in the place? Run 3D Mark. Check it's got enough power. Need to be done in four days. We know we've got that in stock anyway. Um, memory, yeah, we've got a 4 gig stick in stock anyway. So that's fine. So that's running there. The other one is fix and repair. That's coming. Uh, diagnose and repair. Then this one as well. Okay, so that should be fine. That should be fine. What we'll do is we'll get that. Benched, which is it's doing it uh, at three four nine six. So that's probably the highest rating we've had, I think. Then we'll leave that by the door, and then we'll go straight ahead and collect that money, which is good. Discard that one. New bits available, so it's uh, another NZ XT black and red, and then a Pentium G four six hundred. So this is accurate, Gary at accurate girl dot education. What's up? Uh, can make some repairs. There was this weird smell, and now I turn the computer on. It's all black. I'm sure ninety percent sure it's a graphics card, Gary. I replace graphics card and PSU. See, that's the thing. That would be nice in a hardcore mode. That bit there, just we have to deal with it. But this one is saying replace the graphics card and the PSU. So anyway, it'd be nice to just have to work it out ourselves. Or oh, would it be a challenge? Don't know about nice. Anyway, we are going to leave it there. But a little bit of a shorter one this one, but uh, needs most and all of that. So. Cracking on okay, next episode, a couple of fixing repairs, all that sort of thing. We do have a thousand generic units of currency now, which we could probably spend on maybe getting some other tools, but mm, it depends. See, maybe going ahead and uh, getting something like, where is it? Getting something like that, the PC bay would be good, but it's 800, 800 to get it. Hmm. Auto connect tool would actually save my time as well. Uh, we'll see, we'll see. Depends on which we're going to get paid for these other ones. So we'll leave it there. Next episode, we'll crack on and see how far we get. As always, hope you have enjoyed the video. Thanks very much for watching. Take care and generic partings.